This video is sponsored by Skillshare, an online learning community. Wow. Perigoso, perigoso. Oh my god, it's so heavy! The minimalist backpacker! So I hate this already. And, I mean, yeah. uh, we were told that it doesn't really function 100% today, so it's actually closed. Because if you want to come up again, it's not possible today. By the way, welcome to the video. Today we're camping and we are the professional campers. But this is Europe's most steepest cable car. It's 450 meters straight down this cliff. So I'm risking the camera here just for the shot. But can you see just how crazy steep it is? This is Achara da Cruz. It is one of the most unique places on Madeira Island. And we are going to stay here for the night. And we will have it all for ourselves because nobody lives here. It's all agriculture. But there is a kind of a little village. So, you will have fucked up. If you do that, so can I actually have some milk to you? Or have some milk to you? Okay. I mean, so you do it for me. I'm sick of it. I'm sick. You do it only for me. You do it only because you have to be irritated. Because you think it's a good vlog if you genere me. I genere you, Skat. Stay still. We were actually just going here to camp, but then uh, we were told by the guy up there that it's all private. But he has a property here and he allowed us to stay there for the night, which is so cool. So we're following this trail here that goes to the end and then um, we will set camp if we can find this place that the man here. Uh... But this is also, this is his property and he has this little cafe that sometimes are open here behind yeah. the picket fence. And he actually said we could even go in there and have a look if we wanted to, which is so nice. It's a bar that usually is open during summer, but he said he couldn't find uh, anybody to work uh, for him. <laughs> so it's been closed, which is a shame because this is one unique place. Are we going up here? Yeah, I guess so. He said it was nearby the beach and there would be like a lawn kind of land. Is it here? Yeah, maybe we can know also him. Wow, this is amazing! Yeah, I think it's a very good camp spot, this one. I wonder if we can get the plugs down. It yeah, seems, it seems like down. very hard soil. Normalt så nyder man jo aldrig rigtigt de her naturøjeblikke, fordi man har så travlt med at komme videre. Kom videre. Så 
So we just realized that we forgot the, what do you call them, Jon? The ones that you need to put in the soil in order to have the tent standing. So we forgot to check that everything was wet we before we left. Forgot. We forgot. Well, we, you were the one packing the tent, we but both, we forgot. We both collectively forgot to, to, to bring them. I think the upside to not having the plugs is that the soil is rock hard. So even if we had them, we probably couldn't put them in the ground. to learn how to make these Boy Scout nuts. Should we get a pump or not? I told you to get a pump. But don't you think it's, it's good exercise? No. So it ended up taking um, not one hour like last time, but roughly two hours uh, to set up uh, our tent. Is it done? <laughs> I don't think we can get it in the tent. Uh. <laughs> All those nice kisses. Oh, Lara, I just cleaned you. You're already dirty again. I think these are the memories that you remember, you know? Like I, I definitely remember how pleasant you were in all this blaming. You literally blamed me for every single thing no, that went no, wrong. No, no, every, no, oh no. Oh yes, you did. No. I, bla I blamed so you. I bl oh. As you guys know, we are big ambassadors for Skillshare. And the reason is simple. Skillshare has equipped us with a ton of skills. Skillshare has made us better filmmakers, editors and photoshoppers. It has been a wonderful shortcut for us to get skills and knowledge that otherwise would take a lot longer when only applying learning by doing. But Skillshare is not only for video makers like us. On Skillshare you can learn how to make soap, modern calligraphy, woodworking, animation, gardening and much, much more. In this world with a lot of job insecurity, Skillshare is the best platform to give yourself an upper hand. Skillshare is of course also very good at just getting a new hobby, which in our opinion is a lot better than, you know, the mindless Instagram scrolling that a lot of us are too good at. For seven euros a month, Skillshare is a low risk, high reward investment in yourself. And the first 1000 people to use the link below will get a free Skillshare premium membership trial. It actually doesn't look like you are a wild camping because you can see a house in the back of you. Behind you there's like a house. It's such a cute house. Yeah, I don't think you can live in there though. But yeah, um, we had a little uh, bumpy start to it. Uh, we walked a kilometer from the cable car, which is probably 700 meters too much. 
<laughs> With all the backpack we have. They are waving. Are they waving? Yeah. Okay. It's Look, a boat out there. I mean, there. that's why we need to have a little boat here. Hi. If we are going to, to do more actual uh, wild camping without f cold wine and <laughs> chairs and tables and huge tents, we need to get a, a light alternative as well. It would be fun to go into the middle of, of nowhere. Uh, but you know, we're still starting. But actually, I don't, I don't mind this kind of, of camping. I like the idea that we are in the middle of nowhere without really being it. I mean, today, after seven o'clock, we can get back to the car. So we have to stay here, you know? It's true. The cable car uh, stops at seven and then it starts again. I don't know when it I starts. I don't know when it starts. One of the best things about this spot is the fact that there is not anyone down here because the farmers, they go home when they're done working and, you know, it's just us here. It makes us feel like... <laughs> Sorry. It's a mighty fine little kitchen you have here. Yes, it's very cute. Is it on? Now it is. Yeah. Uh, I brought the chair from my bag, not for you. Don't take mother ch mother's chair. If you go that way, uh, you will end in Brazil. We're going there in uh, 63 days, but who's counting? That way, Florida, Canada, Azores, somewhere up here. It's empty. It's empty, but I guess we kind of had an idea that that would happen, right? Because we used it a lot last time. Luckily, I am always thinking ahead like a carpenter He's making stairs. It's very hot. You have to... Oh, actually, it's not too hot anymore. This way, yeah. Det er også det, jeg gør Men du drejer den hele skat. Hold, Hold nu lige ordentligt. kæft, altså. Du ved ikke, hvor varm den her den er. Du siger, jamen, så lad være med at røre på den. Very good. I'm happy to announce that um, we brought salt and pepper. Wow. Really? Really? No. No. And give it this view, what do you see? How many pieces of cheese you want? Uh, how much cheese do we have? There we go. You jellies? You jelly? You jelly? Up, 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 up. Oh. Mm. I know you don't want pickled tomatoes. That's one thing you don't want. Pickled tomatoes? No, pickled uh, cucumber. No, I like it. You like that too? What is up? Uh oh, Amelia. Restaurant style. And we got the little Whoop. chandelier. And our wine. And burger. Wow. How great is this? This is like Michelin star material. <laughs> well, probably not, but it's very nice and it's cozy. And we got the sunset right behind those burgers that wow. is great timing actually wow 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 do you think this dining setup is better than our last yeah i guess it is right? I, mean, I mean it's warm it's much warmer obviously and the food has sold and i mean the view mm. is it good mm. go get it I feel so badass every time I do this. Wow. I also eat my pizza with knife and fork. Yeah, I know you do. Mm. Is it approved? Mm. Mm. You always make good food. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers, honey. Another successful wild camping. Yes.
I'm ready. It's pitch dark. Yeah. Are you enjoying but your? Cheers anyway. Are you, are you enjoying your hot chocolate? Yes, I am. And Amelia made cookies, but you can't see them. What cookies? What is it then? It's dates with uh, pecans. Let's play some Yahtzee. I um, can already tell that this is way too warm in here for me to sleep. It is boiling hot. I asked Amelia if we can sleep outside under the open sky, but you're like, maybe there's like a wild dog that'll eat us. If you want, you can take your sleeping bag and you can sleep in the outer tent. I need the air mattress. Two, three, four, five. What does it? What happened, Jon? I lost because Amelia, she not only has. Tremendous luck in love, uh, but also games. So, drink your sorrow. Losers will have to drink. Good night, guys. Yeah. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Check out this, um, this Milky Way. Favorite time of the day. I slept really good with the, you know, with the waves just relentlessly coming in. For some reason, it really calms you down, right? I, I felt so calm. But we had this bird harassing us all night. Especially ow, this morning. Ow, 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 ow. Sometimes it went right over our tent as if, what the f are you doing in my territory? I slept okay. I mean, I was very relaxed because of the, the birds and, and the waves and everything. But it's just, you know, my back is not so good. I've been a little sick yesterday and today. So, but I mean, it's better to sleep here than many other places. I'm terrified of flying the FPV drone, but I have to learn it. Are you ready? Yeah.
flew the FPV drone successfully, but it seems like the cable cars are not moving. Which is not good. Which is not and good. I'm almost done with the tent, Jon. I'm like, I'm, I'm fast now, because we need to get going. Yeah, because, because they have a part, like a lunch break between 11.30 and 12.30. But the problem is that yesterday when we took the cable car down, we could only take it because we were just staying down here. We couldn't take it up. So all the tourists who wanted to come down here wasn't allowed to, or po it wasn't possible. So um, we're completely screwed if we can't uh, get it. So well, but we're packing now and making it before 11.30, it's 10.17. Oh, so um, I, it, it looked completely empty up there. The cable car is open. Ah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, it's open. <laughs> Are we ready? Well, Let's go. success. <laughs> Come. Goodbye. Bye, Really, we're back in civilization. Yes, we are. And, and uh, this smells like a dream. Honestly, if you like this kind of espetada food, this is the nice one. I is think. this supposed to be the best one in Madeira? Mm. It's good. Mm. You know, I'm still hooked on this. And I love just going somewhere and then, you know, just camp and see what's, what's going to happen. It's like you have a hotel, but you decide exactly yeah. where the hotel should yeah. be. It's like a timeshare you don't have to pay for. Bye okay. guys. See you in the next video. Obrigada por ver o vídeo. Até logo. Até logo. Bye. Goodbye. See you guys. This is the best espetada on Madeira Island. I know what the fuss is about now. Oh my god. I can breathe again and I feel drunk from smelling this, okay? What is it? It's uh, homemade, it's almost like a grappa, but they make it from Madeira sweet wine. So they, they, they actually let it sit after he's making it on the, on the wood. He puts it back in the barrel and then it stays there. And then it tastes like Madeira sweet wine, I think, but it still is a grappa. Oh my God.